In this proposition, we'll find two lines incommensurable in square, whose sum of squares is medial, and product is medial and incommensurable with the sum of the squares. Using proposition 10.32, create two medial lines, AB and BC, commensurable in square only, where AB times BC is medial, and AB squared minus BC squared is equal to X squared where x and ab are incommensurable. Bisect bc at e and mark f so that af times fb is equal to be squared. These two conditions, ab squared minus bc squared equaling x squared, and af times fb equaling be squared, mean that af and fb are incommensurable by proposition 10.18. Now draw the semicircle on AB so that the right triangle ADB can be made. AF and FB are incommensurable, so AB times AF and AB times FB are incommensurable. And by the lemma of proposition 10.33, AB times AF is equal to AD squared, and AB times FB is equal to BD squared, so AD squared and BD squared are incommensurable. AB is medial, so AB squared is medial, and by the Pythagorean theorem, AB squared is equal to AD squared plus BD squared. By the same lemma as before, AF times FB is equal to DF squared, so DF squared is equal to BE squared, so DF equals BE. BC equals 2BE, which is equal to 2DF, so AB times BC is equal to 2AB times DF. AB times BC is medial by assumption, so AB times DF is also medial. By the same lemma, AB times DF is equal to AD times DB, so AD times DB is also medial. AB and BC are incommensurable, but BC is commensurable with BE because it is its double, so AB is also incommensurable with BE. And AB times BE is incommensurable with AB squared, which equals AD squared plus DB squared by the Pythagorean theorem. DF equals BE, and AB times DF is equal to AD times DB, so AD times DB is incommensurable with AD squared plus DB squared. Overall, we have two lines, AD and DB, whose squares are incommensurable, whose sum of squares and product are both medial but incommensurable.